Today, we're diving into a comprehensive comparison between the brand new Xreal One Pro and the Xreal One. Both models come from Xreal, a brand that's been leading the charge in AR innovation. The Xreal One Pro promises a next-generation leap with its flat prism display tech and advanced features while the X Real One offers a balanced, highly customizable experience at a lower price point. But the big question is, which one is best for your needs and style? Well, let's dive into a detailed comparison of these two AR glasses and see which one is the right choice for you. And if you find this video helpful, please help out the channel by giving it a like and subscribing. Let's start off with the display technology and visual experience. This is where the X Real One Pro truly shines. It boasts a groundbreaking flat prism display technology paired with a Sony 0.55-inch micro OLED, simulating a massive 171-inch virtual screen with a wider 57-degree field of view. The visuals are sharper, brighter, and free from edge blur, delivering an immersive experience that feels next-gen. On the other hand, the X Real One features dual 0.68-inch micro OLED displays with a 50-degree field of view and a crisp 1080p resolution. Both glasses support hardware and software-based interpupillary distance adjustments for tailored comfort. While the X Real One delivers a fantastic viewing experience, the Pro's enhanced field of view and innovative display tech make it the winner in this category. When it comes to the design, the X Real One Pro features a sleek, premium design that's slightly more compact thanks to its revolutionary flat prism display tech. These glasses are lightweight and comfortable for extended wear, with a minimalistic look that's a step closer to blending AR glasses into everyday fashion. On the other hand, the X Real One also delivers a lightweight build with adjustable nose pads and frames for a snug fit. While both glasses are designed with comfort in mind, the One Pro's flatter prism design gives it a less bulky appearance, making it feel less intrusive and more like traditional eyewear. If discretion and a modern aesthetic are top priorities, the X Real One Pro has the edge here. Moving on to the features and customization, the X Real One Pro brings a 12 megapixels eye camera accessory, enabling first person photography and potential depth of field tracking for future spatial computing updates. It also runs on the X1 chip with Optic Engine 4.0 and promising a gesture based interactions down the line. On the flip side, the X Real One has its own strengths, including a built in menu system for customizing screen size, distance, and position. It also offers electrochromic dimming for its lenses, letting you switch between transparent and opaque modes, perfect for immersive cinema like experiences or staying aware of your surroundings. While the Pro focuses on cutting edge features that hint at future AR potential, the One's intuitive menu and versatile lens dimming give it a practical edge for current use. When it comes to the compatibility and usability, the X Real One and One Pro are both highly versatile, offering seamless connectivity with smartphones, laptops, tablets, and gaming devices like the Steam Deck. The X Real One's user friendly menu system and quick plug and play functionality make it especially accessible for first time AR users. On the other hand, the One Pro is geared toward tech enthusiasts who want to explore emerging AR capabilities like spatial computing. If you're focused on ease of use, the X Real One gets the edge here. But for those excited about cutting edge features, the X Real One Pro is the way to go. As for my final verdict, the X Real One Pro is undoubtedly a leap forward in AR technology, offering a wider field of view, sleek design, and future focused features like the eye camera. It's perfect for those who want to stay at the forefront of AR innovation. On the flip side, the X Real One holds its ground as a well rounded, versatile option with practical features like lens dimming and an intuitive menu. It's ideal for gaming, watching movies, and general everyday use. Thanks for tuning in to this comparison. If you found it helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more tech reviews and comparisons. See you in the next one.